The western coast of Norway boasts some of the world's most breathtaking landscapes, shaped by glaciers over centuries. Fjords, stretching up to 200 kilometers inland and over a kilometer deep, define this picturesque region. Currently, traversing this terrain involves a convoluted journey along Norway's E39 highway, covering 100 kilometers in 21 hours. Recognizing the need to enhance access to services and connect residential and labor markets in the western regions, the Norwegian government has embarked on its most ambitious infrastructure project to date. The E39 highway spans from Kristiansand in the south to Trondheim in the north, navigating fjords through seven ferry crossings. The groundbreaking coastal highway project aims to replace ferry services with an extensive network of bridges and tunnels. The Rogfast project, a 27-kilometer undersea tunnel connecting Stavanger and Haugesund, is the first in a series. It reaches depths of 390 meters below sea level, setting records as the world's deepest and longest undersea road tunnel. Scheduled for completion in 2026, at a cost of 2 billion Rogfast features emergency exits, laybys, and an intersection connecting the island municipality of Kvitsoy to the mainland. Some fjords like the 5 kilometer wide and 600 meter deep Bjornefjord present extreme engineering challenge for Norway's coastal highway. Proposed solutions include a floating bridge anchored at both ends and a three-tower suspension bridge. For Sulafjord, options include a three-tower suspension bridge or a submerged floating tunnel tethered to the seabed. Crossing Norway's coastal highway, Romsdalsfjord requires a 16 kilometer undersea tunnel, followed by a two kilometer suspension bridge. The most complex challenge is at Sornefjord, Norway's largest and deepest fjord. Spanning 3.7 kilometers wide and 1.3 kilometers deep, it accommodates frequent ship traffic. The project team of Norway Coastal Highway considers various options, such as a traditional suspension bridge, a floating bridge with ship passage challenges, a submerged floating tunnel suspended from pontoons, and a hybrid solution combining a floating pontoon bridge with a submerged floating tunnel. The proposed multi-span cable-stayed bridge for Norway's coastal highway features floating pylons tethered to the seafloor. This vast coastal highway project not only addresses engineering complexities, but also prioritizes safety and environmental considerations. It is poised to set new benchmarks for global infrastructure projects.